advocacy, okay? And what we do here is we teach chunking. <laughs> and I need to explain chunking. We have a communications um, faculty that two, a husband and wife team that are here teaching a program called the Articulate Advocate. And one of the things they talk about, it really works. It's when you're trying to convince somebody, you tell, you say, I'm trying to convince you. That's called chunking. And what I'm chunking is not only what I'm holding here, bookshelving, but I'm also chunking with my voice. Now my children, I have three of them, believe that when I chunk, I'm yelling at them. And I'm being very stern because it makes me sound authoritative. Okay, that's chunky. Okay, now about Nita. Um, Nita is back to its roots. Um, I was uh, talking earlier with some of you. We started in 1972 at the University of Colorado here in Boulder. And what we are is we're a bunch of volunteer lawyers from all over the country that help other lawyers be better in the courtroom, okay? And what we say is we are training young lawyers and some old lawyers that don't get into the courtroom as much as they used to, how to be more effective and ethical lawyers, okay? Heavy emphasis on the ethical because we believe in that very strongly. Now, in 1972, the United States Supreme Court, Chief Justice Berger had said, Lawyers appearing in the courtroom don't know what they're doing, and we really need to train them. And several officials from various organizations around the country banded together, and this included one of our very own, Jim R. Kerrigan, who was uh, is, was a lawyer here in town. He was on the state Supreme Court now, and then he was a federal court, uh, federal district court judge. He still lives in Boulder. He was one of the founders. And starting in July of 72, we started running programs where lawyers and, uh, and law students get to stand up in mock trial situations. They watch a demonstration by an experienced lawyer, and then they stand up and practice doing opening statements, closing arguments, examination of witnesses. And we've been doing that since 1972. Initially, the first program here was four weeks long. We called it a boot camp. We now run 40 public, 40, almost 50 public programs around the country, multiple private programs around the country, but the model is still the same. Learning by doing, telling lawyers uh, how they can improve a performance, and that's, uh, that's what we do. We actually videotape them. We sit down with them, review the videotape, and we, we tell them how they can improve the next time they get up in the courtroom. Our programs are not quite four weeks long anymore because lawyers don't seem to have as much time as we did back in 1972 to disappear from their offices and spend four weeks in Boulder, Colorado at the University of Colorado uh, to, to uh, learn these skills. What we have done is we've expanded the programming so that we have programs in almost every major city, not every major city, but major cities around the country and, and in many states, teaching both trial skills and deposition skills. And we're expanding into uh, what we call transi transactional or persuasive skills for lawyers who don't always appear in the courtroom. Uh, what, uh, when I said we're returning to our roots, for the longest time, we just staged programs, didn't have our own facility until about 2006 when we moved into Louisville, just down the road. And uh, we had our first, first teaching facility, which is just like this one. Uh, and uh, then we, we lease came up, and it was time to move, and we got lucky and we got to come back to our roots here in, in Boulder, Colorado. And I don't mean to offend Louisville, because we had a wonderful wonderful state in Louisville, uh, but uh, it's kind of fun to be back to our roots. And I'd like to welcome all of you uh, to come out here. We're actually celebrating our 40th anniversary uh, this summer, 
at, uh, we're going to stage the program because uh, this facility is too small for 72 participants, which we're hoping to have 72 participants. And then we're having a uh, special reunion of people that have gone through this program or taught at this program. And that's all going to be at the end of July of, uh, of this year. So uh, if you want to know more about that, you want to come and, uh, and watch, you can. Uh, we'd be glad to have you, and we're at the University of Colorado. But thank you for uh, having us in Boulder. We're glad to be back. Thank you.